Are you always getting knots in your neck and pain that goes up into the top of the neck? If you do, you're in the right place. This condition that you're probably suffering with is a condition called levator scapula levator syndrome. Levator scapula is a muscle that starts next to the scapula, it attaches to the scapula, and it travels up and it goes to the first four vertebrae in your neck. Most often people will describe this as knots in their neck, pain, spasms in their neck. A lot of times patients will come into my office and they simply just can't even turn their head. It's that bad. And sometimes it'll give people headaches. Well today, I'm gonna to show you exactly how to self-treat this. Well what you can do is you can do self-myofascial release or what's called trigger point therapy. And one of the things that's useful is one of these things called the nobbles. And this is in place of your hands. Now one could use your hands by hooking your fingers and pressing on it, but very often I find this is much easier for self-help. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take it in your hand, reach across your body, get it right into the trigger point area, and press down. And all you have to do is hold this position for 5, 10, 15, 20 seconds, long enough until the sensitivity starts to go down. Once that occurs, you can start to press in other areas along the, the neck, and you'll follow along until you get to the top here. Now as long as you stay behind the midline of your neck, you're actually safe. You're not gonna hurt yourself. Try not to stay on the front of the neck, of course, because your carotid arteries are there, but if you stay on the back, very often you could relieve some trigger point pain. Very often by using this and applying deep pressure to the muscle, it'll often relieve some of the discomfort that you're feeling. And how it does that is it neurologically calms the muscle down. That's actually what's happening. You're not squishing a muscle uh, spasm down. You're actually stimulating nerves that sense discomfort. And by increasing that stimulation to those particular nerves, it actually has a reflex and calms the muscle down. That's actually how this works. If you found this video useful or informative, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If you have any specific questions or comments, leave them in the comments section below. And if you wanna to subscribe to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. I really do appreciate it. And you have a great day.